that. <laughs> uh, it's as it was in the packet. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, that, that. Okay, very okay. good. No more caramel grads for the. No more? <laughs> well, we might have to chat. <laughs> Okay, so any other discussion? Uh, Madam Mayor, I just want to thank you for having the, uh, the foresight to see that as uh, Trustee Desmond has talked about, and we already are seeing a development where we're, we're redeveloping some banks. You've got Walgreens coming in, you've got some more medical coming in, um, and that's the 90th District Corridor. That does not include the Cicero Corridor, and based off of the information that's coming in the <clears throat> uh, uh, building of Mariano's we're gonna have a lot of development coming into this village especially if the economy remains uh, remains strong like it like it looks like it's gonna be and nobody can predict but I think it's good because I do know that being at some of the PD and C meetings I think that some of their meetings are last uh, longer than uh, some of our meetings so I, I think it's it's good to be able to get more people involved and to be involved in their community so right, right. Very Madam good. And these, these uh, individuals would not have a voting authority also. Uh, right. uh, Trustee Carberry, then Trustee Desmond. And, and I did want to thank again, Tim, thank you for this uh, report. And I don't know if you put a dollar value to it, but it's, I imagine it's, it would be uh, well into the, uh, the millions and millions and millions of dollars of construction. So that was a great report to see it all condensed like that. It is a lot going on. And I do think this... Um, the gentleman, his, his credentials, Paul Vale's credentials, will be, will be a big help to the board. And I know, um, uh, you know, Pina Peruta would be, I think, the only, um, the only female. Yes. On the board, which is a good thing, right? And um, sometimes. <laughs> yeah. And uh, and maybe the first, right? Is that? Um, I do don't know, know. Uh, Commissioner no, Eggert. Uh, we've yeah, had before. Marge Marnier. Marge Marnier. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Trustee does. Oh, okay. We're yeah, good. that's I'm okay. done. Thank you, madam. Um, yeah, we've from the support we've seen the the work done on 111 Street, all the work being done on 95th Street, and um, I would challenge our new advisory board and report to take a look at uh, 87th Street. <laughs> now it's about time we uh, turned our attention to um, the north side of town. Excellent. Uh, any other comments, uh, Commissioner Eggert? Uh, no, thank you. Okay, very good. And thank you for hanging around for that. I'm sorry, it, it, it was a little too lengthy to get into before. Uh, oh, thank you very much. Okay, so we're going to move on. Uh, oh, we've got to take the roll. Thank you. Trustee Strait? Yes. Trustee Lenichik? Yes. Trustee Desmond? Yes. Trustee Carberry? Yes. Trustee Vorder? Yes. Motion passes. In District 5, I'd like a reappointment, please, to this commission of Mr. Bill Lundy. I have a motion, please, on Mr. No approve. Properly moved by Trustee Carberry. Second. <coughs> Excuse me. Seconded by Trustee Olenichik. Any discussion? Please take the roll. Trustee Strait? Yes. Trustee Olenichik? Yes. Trustee Desmond? Yes. Trustee Carberry? Yes. Trustee Vorder? Yes. Motion passes. And one of the at-large commissioners, Mr. Rich Piazza. I'd like a motion, please, for his reappointment to this motion commission. Approved. Properly moved by Trustee Olenichik. Second. Seconded by Trustee Desmond. Any discussion? Please take the roll. Trustee Stray? Yes. Trustee Olenichik? <coughs> Trustee Desmond? Yes. Trustee Carberry? Yes. Trustee Vorder? Yes. Motion passes. Okay. <laughs> Item D, our website is now live. This is the new website. Village staff have done an amazing job. I want to thank Josh. I want to thank everyone uh, who uh, did such a fantastic job with this website. Uh, it's beautiful. I want to publicly congratulate them on this impressive effort. Uh, the new website allows us to more closely interact with residents. Uh, it allows searches and it works better overall. Uh, we are so excited about it. Um, one of the enhancements that really, really makes me happy and I'm so proud of is it allows our, us to make our government more transparent. 
the Illinois Policy Institute ranks municipalities on transparency. And back in May, when, when I took office, Oak Lawn's score was about 41.5%. Uh, this put us right between Cicero and Decatur. It wasn't something residents could be very proud of. And I'm very proud to announce that as of today, Mr. Costin from the Illinois Policy Institute uh, said that Oak Lawn's transparency score is now 86.1% and Oak Lawn now qualifies for the Sunshine Award. So that is an amazing accomplishment in a few months, in addition to the new website. Uh, so this was a great and coordinated effort by staff on behalf of residents who want to learn more about their village. I sincerely want to thank them. And of course, our goal is 100% as soon as possible. So I can assure you that uh, we are not going to rest until then, but for now, I am just thrilled that we have more than doubled our transparency score. It's an absolutely fantastic job, everyone. I can't thank you enough. Um, and then uh, for general village matters, the weather has been crazy. We've had blizzards, cold, floods, water main breaks. Uh, the village staff really, really cared and gave it uh, they're all with professionalism and pride. Um, and I also want to thank the media as well uh, for helping to get the word out about the severe weather and the communication. Um, and with that, I'd like a motion to adjourn. So moved. Properly moved by Trustee Olenichek. Second. Seconded in stereo, but I'm going to give it to Trustee Desmond. Uh, <laughs> any discussion? Please take the roll. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Motion passes. Thank you. I thought we were going to executive session.